2020, I was held a dream. Hello, guys out there. This is me, the one who had a dream. Bless your listening. Hi, guys. Before I start the video, I want to say like this is my first video, so I'm so sorry for the light, um, my sound, and whatever that's not good. So let me introduce myself before I'm gonna talk about my dream. My name is Sukapon Ava. I'm from Thailand. I live in the northern part of Thailand. So, and I love it nature and I love this so much. And behind, right back here, did you say it's so beautiful? <laughs> so sorry. I'm sorry for my exes and everything that I have done to this video I'm sorry for my vocabularies and thank you for you guys for watching this video I hope you guys enjoy and pray for my English as well so I can better and better and I can make a new videos about like what's going on in my life what have Jesus done for me I mean like God okay so let's start I want to talk about my dream it's not my dream but it's my dream God give give this dream for me it's such a vivid and colorful and such a rapture dream in my life I never have been like enjoy this entire of my life this from this dream actually it's just a dream right but I'm so grateful peaceful like I feel like I'm not the part of this world anymore. I mean, like anymore. Um, at that time, I was looking for my little sister. She was at my cousin's house, so I just like being there with her and talk with them and chatting with my cousin. And suddenly, I just want. I just feel like I want to look up to this guy and then let's just look up to this guy and guess what I saw? the planets a lot of planets up there like in the sky I just feel like whoa this is so beautiful what is going on? I gotta take a photo of that I got to do that and share to my friends my dad asked me like wanna go for a drive but I don't know why is he gonna go so I just feel like, no dad and my dad is gone my dad was gone in my dream like just that I say no after I say no I mean after I say no my dad has gone and I don't know why is he and just just one bling eye that I like this <laughs> it's kind of like funny but I was at my back my backyard behind my house there were me my grandma and my cousin we talking and chatting and we just and they didn't know they're gonna think like the earth right there and I just look up to the sky again and I saw that earth that we with earth right there with the earth shop is slowly sailing that is go I don't know where it's going but it's just I feel like it's so beautiful and it's going somewhere yeah it's going somewhere that I don't know and then I at that time the phone the phone is like right there like in my hand and I just grab it up and grandma said to me like look at this and I don't know what's going on but the Bible words ran to my mind ran bro up bro up in my mind like when Jesus come when God come and return look up to the sky and you will see everything gonna shine the sky will turn it to dark and the moon will turn it to like black moon I don't know is that real so I just search for it after my dream has done but okay let's continue 
So it's just like the Bible verse ran into my mind, right? So it's just like, oh, what I'm doing? Why I didn't know that God's coming? So it's just like, hallelujah, God is coming, God is coming. Look, everyone, look. But actually, they were me, my grandma and my cousin, right? They are gone. They were gone in my dream. Also, like my dad. I don't know where are they. I don't know like where are they. Where were they at that time? They were gone. All of them. I just thought, I got to tell anybody about this story. So I just look up to the sky again, and I saw like it's kind of like fire fireballs, like many many falling down. Falling down and falling down to my head, and did that? Do you remember that I have saw the earth right there with the old ship, right? That ship is sailing so far, and then the earth falling down to my head, but it's gonna, it's like boom, and then I'm not hurt or anything. And at that time that I saw the fire ball is falling down, right? I didn't feel like I fear or I scare or like. I wanna cry. Oh, I feel like where is anybody? What is going on? No, I didn't feel like that. I feel like Jesus is coming. Look, everybody, Jesus is coming, but there is no one right there over me. And I talk only me, and I'm talking to myself like Jesus is coming. And I just like Hallelujah, Hallelujah. And um, like how to say after. I talking with myself right there, right. I ran to in front of my house, and I got to say like there were only my little sister, my older sister, and my mom. I have seven siblings, include me. Three, three older sister, two younger brother, and one little sister, and. I got two moms with my dad, with two wives in my house. But we are all love each other, and we never fight them for like something that we love each other and we care each other because we are family. I know it's kind of weird that two wife, two mom in the same house would. Only one there, but we all love each other and we care each other and everything. And we all are Christian. And I know it's kind of like it's not that kind of good story of my life, but I'm good and I'm okay with that. I accept with that and I grow up with that, so I'm okay with that. And there were only, like I said, there were only my mom, my real mom, my older sister. And my younger sister. And at that time, I didn't feel like where's others, where are others. I feel like I got to say anybody like Jesus coming, mom, sister, look at there, sister is coming, fire's burning, falling down. Then don't, don't you see anything like what I saw? And you know what? They just thinking my mom. I can tell my mom thinking on her mind like, "What are you talking? Like, what is going on?" And everyone, everyone acting like normal, like normal day, normal life. Like, my sister was cleaning the car. My mom just mopping, and my sister was praying instead of me, who is telling Hallelujah back in backyard and ran so fast to my family. And telling about what is going on is, and they were like acting normal, and they just like nothing is happen. And then after my mom say like what is going on, I woke up. My dream has gone, and I was pray to God like, God, thank you for this dream. I have prayed for like many time for month. That I want kind of like vivid dream and wrap the dream and what is gonna happen to this world. I want to have this kind of dream in my life. 
please give it to me and on 26 May 2019 at 5 a.m. I had a dream and I'm thank you Lord that he gave it to me and he revealing to me after my dream was done I mean like it was gone I thought my mom said like what's going on I pray to God and I wrote what I can remember to my note on a, on my phone and I'm still safe it until today here right there and yes it's in Thai so you can pause and read it as you can and I have to say like thank you for you guys who watching this video um thank you so much I don't know like people gonna watching this video or not but thank you even one person who saw this video I know God is gonna praise you and pray with you so before I gonna leave I have to say like thank you for everyone who watching this video thank you for coming here together and pray for us you know and we know like what is going on on this earth right now and this is for one dream for you guys out there please be prepared and ready for god return